Good afternoon, good evening, and good night, and welcome to Throwbacks, and welcome to this week's toy hunt. We are on our way to Daytona currently, so of course you gotta get some fig hunting on the way. Honestly, this week I'm not really high on anything as far as uh, things I need, so that's a good thing, because last week kind of was expensive with a few pre-orders coming through and things like that. We did uh, end on a high last week for sure with uh, finding the Ultimate Edition Rowdy Piper and Bret Hart for the Monday Night Wars collection. So, money was spent there. Let's see. Need you guys need a rubble and crew? Let's see. Anything exciting here at the random side of the road Walmart? Let's see. Um, the answer is unless you want a charming, cozy toilet, no. So, I'm gonna head on over to the figs. Alright, what do we got? It's always fun trying to figure out unfamiliar toy aisles. We'll figure it out. I don't think anybody's ever gotten completely lost and never found again in the toy aisle, so. Now that's a cool, ah, uh, well. I thought it was cool, I thought it was a old school robot, robotnik, robotnik? Oh, oh my. Oof, 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 oof. Heavy on the oof there. Oh, series 98. Yeah, we're a few past that, pal. We are a few past that. Well, I do have the new, new-ish Roman, so that's at least something good on them. The regular basics, same old, same old. Jay Uso, Sami Zayn. Yep, not a lot going on there. Like a little bit of Star Wars. See any black series? It's interesting. It's Jurassic Park. A few Marvel Legends. Not much going on there. A very small turtle section compared to what we've got back home. Another small Transformer section. Uh, pretty uh, not tight. So kind of a bust. Oh come on! Just because we're on the road and on the way to Daytona, you think we're not gonna stop at Good Old Ross? You gotta know me better than that by now. <laughs> Let's go see if there's anything that I can't live without. No, oh, no, it's one of these Rosses where it's just garbage piled up on the side. All right, all right, let's focus, focus in, focus in. We've got Skelly God again, very good figure. Adam Smasher, five dollar. Good price there for that. All right, anything? I always liked these places as, as a kid. The little airport thing. I always found those. Found those to be fun. Random side note there. Oh, you go. Here's a little Luigi. Eleven dollars. I think they were clearanced out a little lower than that at uh, Target recently. Here's a super brawly. It's cool. It's probably like a million dollars. Oh, 16. It's not bad. Oh, 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 oh. Stuff's trying to run away. Getting away from it. Okay. A little Vegeta action. Oh, still 15. Sanderson Sisters. Some more Dragon Ball. Some more Mario. What do we got back here? What are these? The, uh, how are those called? The Apex guys. Okay. Well, nothing for me. Nothing for me. Which is, again, not a bad thing. Not a bad thing at all. Alright. Check around just in case there's something hiding on some end cap peg or something like that. I'm still tempted by this. Ah, oh, six bucks. Still tempted. I gotta say strong. I've got enough of those things that I don't even actually need, so staying strong. Alright, let's go. Yeah, why not? It's a 
Beautiful day out, wind's blowing. Let's see if uh, Barnes and Nobles has anything. Yeah, short of a few Harry Potter wands. Doesn't seem to be too many figure type things, but tons of uh, comics and anime books and stuff like that, so eh, worth a look. Alright, I'm clearly not young or new age enough for that because that's a whole lot of Starbucks, a whole lot of Apple computers, just a whole lot of, of a lot. But hey, you know, each their own, right? Each their own. Uh, what else am I going to do? Uh, you know what? I'm going to go down here. There's a five uh, below. Check that out and then uh, head on over to uh, meet my daughter and get on back to where the heck I live. Let's go. All right, we got a Burlington. We got a five below. We might as well hit both. So go ahead and let's go. All right, they got tons and tons of the little uh, Funko minis and regular Funkos, really. Looks like what we got over here some kind of knickknacky things. I mean, it's all knickknacky. It's five bucks, mainly knickknacky. Um, yeah, Crash Bandicoot and a really creepy Eleven. Yeah. Alright, let's we'll keep checking it out. It might be something worth noting. Some more of the little things I got from... I got that little mini barbecue the other day. I don't think anything that I need for any of my dioramas, but... Yeah, cool stuff all the same. Could definitely be for some people's, no doubt. Alright, anything else I need, want, or just can't live without? Probably not. Well, if I find anything, we'll pop back on. If not, I'll see you at the guess Burlington Coat Factory. Mm. All right. Well, I can't say I haven't bought anything on these last like five times because I picked up three Chico sticks for the grand total of a dollar seven. What am I doing in my life? Well, I'm gonna be eating a Chico stick. That's one thing I'm gonna be doing. And then I'm gonna go in here and uh, see what's going on at Burlington Coat Factory. All right, the epitome of adulthood is coming to the toy section of a Burlington Coat Factory. Yeah, same price as uh, Ross. Eating a Chico steak, looking at figs. Not bad. Not a bad day, though. Way to spend the day, I guess. Hmm. Anything exciting? Lots of, lots of the lady stuff. Are there any? This one I've never seen, of course, it's... It wouldn't show up in my algorithm. Is like, uh, you know, female toy hunters that are hunting, you know, old school girl stuff. I should, uh, I should search that out. It would be an interesting take on that kind of market there. Let's see where they run at them here. I mean, five bucks still isn't bad considering what they originally run, but I know Ross got them for like, I think that was just like three bucks, so. Well, nothing here. Didn't think there would be, but I needed something to do for a few minutes. So, if you need something to do for a few seconds, because that's all it takes to like, to comment, and to subscribe to this lovely channel that we call Throwbacks and help us get to that 500 subscriber mark, that would be cool. But until then, let's go ahead and head to the next store and see what's going on. All right, back in the good old Wally world to check out some clearance. Uh, let's see what we got. Anything at all. Oh, okay, these are already going on clearance. Seven dollars. Six dollars, six dollars. Ten, seven. Eh, almost tempted just to check them out, but I think seven. <laughs> Seven's actually not bad, but if it was like a character that I needed, unfortunately I've gotten, we've gotten a lot of Luke's and a lot of uh, Ahsoka's lately, so that's an easy pass for me. Let's get one of these little mini figs. Still at 15 for Mr. Moss Man. I think I've seen him for 10 at one point. Oh, $12. Look at there. 12 oh, schmackaroos. 
That's a pretty steal of a deal, huh? It's <laughs> a pretty good deal. What comes with this guy? Is it just the just the thing and the thing? Just the thing and the thing. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe we'll come back. Alright, off to the actual toy aisle. Alright, made it to the toy area, at least. Let's see, it's got wrestling hanging out over here. Oh. Godzilla. Some wish figures. Looks like the Star Wars thing is down there. Lots and lots and lots of Pokemon. Some Godzilla. I think that's a new one. Of the new ones, at least. Four piece diorama. Huh. More turtles, of course. Spider Man, Marvel Legends. What do we got going on here? Star Wars, Star Wars. Hmm. Same Star Wars as. Been here for quite a while. Cad Bane. The chieftain, you know, okay. I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say they don't have the new legends. Legends, uh, ultimates. Still the same going on there. Superstars looking about the same. Moss Man. And everybody else looking about the same. I'm kind of tempted by that Roman, but we're going to get so many Romans, and there's really no upgrade to that, so, $20, which we know that's less because it's over on the other side, anything, top picks, Seamus, Sammy, Nicholas, alright, a million Kenny Omegas, Anything else? Alright. Well, looks to be about it. I'll have to get some sweet tea and ramen noodles or something. I don't know. We'll see. Yep. Happy uh, solar eclipse day, right? Something like that. Look at it. It's just so eclipsed. Yeah. I got tea. No toys. Just tea. Alright. Back to good old... Target. Hmm. I'm not sure that I've seen these at uh, Target. Interesting. Well, the two packs still hanging out. For anybody that needs those, I am not currently one of those. I'm standing strong. I'm not getting one. Although they're pretty cool. But uh, I don't really know what I'm looking for. Kind of been the common theme here at Target lately. Uh, since I've been hunting all the Monday Night War stuff that are obviously Walmart exclusives, but all the same, let's see if we get lucky and find some of the new legends, which doesn't appear to be the case. So it's one of the new legends right there. But instead, we've got a extremely old Luger still hanging out and big Pop a Pop, which I'm kind of surprised that that those have seemed to kind of peg warm a little bit those big papa pumps um, so that was kind of interesting oh here's a, a little hey there a nice little Star Wars section it's pretty cool more clone so that's always nice to see oh look at there Transformers 30% off let's see is it still going to be 30% off whenever you guys see this video 4-13 yeah should be alright so get out there and get after that if you're uh Transformers fan. Fright features. These are cool. Fifteen cool? Probably not. But cool all the same. Some new Joe Cobra Viper. Airborne this one Uncle BJ did a review on recently. I don't think he did a quick kick video yet. And a Cobra Big Boa. I had to send him a picture and see if he needs those. And there's the tombstone, spider shot, last stand Spider Man. Oh, pretty good at rhyme time here, last stand Spider Man. Alright. Let's see, anything in cap clearance? And, oh, 
Looks like there might be something down there. Let's go see. All right. Um, that's a whole lot of nothing. Some old AEW from a very long time ago. Still holding strong. Because, because reasons. All right, go check the neck cassette. See if they have any of the Hall of Thon stuff. I don't need any of it, but it would be cool to see. Let's go. Oh, of course. Of course, of course, we are back at Ross. Let's see what we got going on hanging out over here on the side. Some Wakanda Forever. $8.99. Dang, Luigi's more expensive than Mario. What's going on? That's surprising. Optimus Primal hanging out there. Transformers fan. Fantastic Four, Psycho Man. That's a cool figure. I'll give that credit. All right, let's go head to the back and see if we uh, see anything that we can't live without. All right, what do we got? Looks like someone's been doing a good job of facing, getting all the stuff out there. A little Raph, Raph, and Don. Again, I'm just a little too cheap to pay 15 bucks. I know that's on me. I'm sure that's a probably a decent deal, but that's not one that I can stomach. All right, anything else besides the really awkward kid noises going on? Let's see. More of the oh no, someone took him. Some kid probably took it and pocketed him. That's a bummer. Oh well. Still hanging out. Cheapy, cheapy Power Ranger. Alright, well. That appears to be all. On to the next one. Alright, let's end the week at a good old Ollie's run. And uh, we'll head on over to the thrift store after that. Apparently they're getting uh, some WWE 4-packs in. So... See if we can get lucky and find those. Let's go. Alright, let's see what we got going on. WWE Superstars. That's all those Hulk Hogan's and Ric Flair's. Alright. Let's check it out. Have they lowered the prices yet? Nope. Still $8. Rey Mysterio. Which is Ray? $12. Oh. $6? Twelve dollars, six dollars, twelve dollars. I need to pick up one of those rays. I do not have a modern Rey Mysterio. Eternals. They finally dropped these. Well, a little bit, seven ninety nine. I mean, it is a drop, so. All right, no four packs there. Let's check on the other side. Still plenty of uh, starting lineups. Cool figures. Definitely not a line that I would collect. And definitely not a line that I would collect like their original price tag of, I think it was like 50, 60, 70 bucks. I think it was actually like 70 bucks because it came with a uh, NFT or whatever, which is nuts. All right, definitely gonna have to keep an eye up top. But it doesn't seem to be anything. I see some Star Wars. I'll have to double check and make sure that's nothing I need. Motu. Well, I've said it before on here, but it's definitely one thing that uh, Ollie's needs to do is to follow up on their pricing. And, and yeah, like it's good stuff, cheap, but. Um, you know, at some point, if it's been here for three, four years, you should probably uh, go ahead and lower that price, especially when you have like 30, 40, 50 of them. Alright, what do we got going on up here? That's, uh, what's her face? Obi Wan. Sorry, you're just staring at nonsense. Alright, there's some stuff. What it's worth. Alrighty, well, I think. That's it for here. We'll head on over next door and see what's going on at the old thrift store. Alright. Into the thrift store. 
VHSs? Maybe. We'll see. The office board games. This could be interesting. See if I decide to look through that. Oh lord. Anybody need a broken Hannah Montana guitar? You never know. You never know. school Batmobile. It's pretty cool. Anything else? I'll just check these little grab baggies here, but that's just some Happy Meal type thing. What is most annoying toy? A little putting green thing looks like. Or chipping. Thing. And a bag full of cars. What do we got here? Oh, what's this? A little bag of Pokemon? For five bucks? Sure. I'll give that to the kids. The kids will like that. Alright. Cool deal. See? Found something. Uh, it's probably like, what, 25 cents a card or something? 10, 15 cents a card? Either way, for five bucks. I think that's fair. Alright, um, just the hunt for Back to the Future, Back to the Future, good lord, Batman Forever glasses or Flintstone glasses, always gotta check those when you're hitting these thrift stores, some Mickey glasses, pretty cool, um, yeah, I don't see anything, so, alright, well, let's pop back over and see if there's anything in the movie section, but, uh, otherwise we'll wrap it up. Alright, no VHS's, but I did come across Santa Claus and the original Santa Claus, so I think that's that's worth picking up. Um, other than that, I think that's going to be it. So, I think we're going to wrap it up there. So, for myself and the rest of the Throwbacks team, thanks for hanging out. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Alright, so, quick after action report these are uh, kind of like I guess the good cards I don't really know anything about Pokemon but these are all like the foil cards that were in that little five dollar bag trainers and then kind of the basics and some energy so I don't know for five bucks did I did I do good I don't know hopefully the kids don't destroy them all well like they're destroying the house right now <laughs> alright guys see you guys later